stoichiometry. Man, what's a stoichi? That's right, Greek word meaning element. Uh huh. So, element. What about metry? That's right, measurement. Measurement. Oh, great. Okay, wait a minute. What about geometry? Ah, uh, so you know what geometry is, right? Uh huh. What about trigon? Ah, uh, you know what trigon? That means a triangle. The same thing, right? Okay, trigonometry. You know what geo means, right? That's the land. Long time ago, they started with it, so measuring the land. Okay, that's what they are starting, which is the mathematics, geometry. That's right. What about trigonometry? Uh huh. That's very important, right? Okay, study of a triangle. That's it. Measurement. That's it. So, what comes to your mind? Okay, smaller than element. That's right. It's an atom. Uh huh. Okay, we're gonna talk about the difference between atom and element. Uh huh. Element. What about after that? Okay, few elements together make a molecule, right? Ah, uh, molecule. Okay, so few molecules together, so many molecules together make mixture. That's right. Oh, mixture. So mixture is like all kinds mixed together, which is what? Like a uh, sample is salt water or like a uh, good sample, air. That's right. That's mixture, right? Okay, oxygen gas, nitrogen gas, helium. You're talking about like carbon dioxide, everything there. Okay, let's talk about atom then. Okay, what about oh, most popular one? Oxygen. That's right. Oxygen atom. Oh, oh, no numbers, nothing. That's it. Or hydrogen. Oh, that's atom, right? Okay, what about element? Oh, element is like this one. So maybe O. Oh, that's element also. Okay, what about O2? Oh, that's it. Oxygen gas. What about O3? Oxygen 3, which is ozone. That's right, ozone gas. Okay, they are elements. Okay, what about molecule? Oh, that's right. Maybe H2O. That's right. Two different elements together make molecules. Okay, so like a Oh, what about salt water? Oh, NaCl, that's salt, plus water. That's it, that's a mixture. Also, we're curious about these numbers right here, right? Small numbers right here, this is how many atoms, okay? Then, what about number front of some number? Like a five, something like that, five. That means a five molecules of water, that's which is five moles, okay? Okay, let me show you one more example, okay, which is calcium phosphate. How about that? That's right. Calcium phosphate the, in our bone system. That's it. That's what calcium phosphate. Calcium phosphate. Ooh. Just like this. Anyway, I'm going to show you this one. How about that? Oh, this is a present right here. Ooh, man, looking good. All right. Now, first one. That's right, hydrogen. Oh, everybody knows that one, right? Okay, oxygen. Oh, is hiding right here, number eight, which is the molecular weight is sixteen, right? Okay, what about calcium? Oh, that's number twenty. You know what? All you have to worry about just twenty. That's it. Okay, don't worry about the hundred some. Oh, that's oh, oh, don't worry about it. Now, oh, uh, let's talk about this one. The first one, right? The left hand side is hydrogen. Hydrogen is number one, okay, which is also we call this one first column. First column means, okay, it's so very easy. The first one is a positive one. How about that? Okay, positive two, positive three, oh, and four, okay, right here. Okay, so going this way, that's positive. Now, all the way to the number eight, oh, that's number eight, it's full, so they're not going to mess around with uh, any other uh, ion. Okay, so this one also we can call zero. Okay, this one, so from the right hand side, this is negative one, negative two, negative three, and negative four. See? Okay, that's why we call this portion right here. Oh man, very important. 
carbon and silicon. Oh, so we call this one, that's right, semi. Because of half and half, right? Positive for negative for. That's why we use this silicon for computer chip. That's it. Okay, the semiconductor. Yeah, we are going to talk about this one big time later. Okay, don't worry. Okay. Uh, uh, okay, now uh, let's talk about PO4. Uh huh, PO4. Okay, let's look at P first. Okay, usually the chemical left hand side is positive, right hand side negative, which is the ionic bonding case. Okay, oh, let's look at this one. Okay, PO4. Okay, P is what? Okay, number one, right here, one, two, three, four, and five. That's number five, which is P. Oh, that's a positive five. I'm telling you. Now, what about O? O is a negative one, negative two, right there. Oh, that's negative two, but four times, see, O4, that's why negative eight. Oh, wait a minute. Okay, together, negative eight and five together, totally what? Negative three, that's it. Just like that, see? I just put negative signs, the three of them, right there. Now, oh, now we're gonna talk about calcium. Oh, calcium, wait a minute, oh, hiding right here. Okay, so one, two, oh, second column. So this one must be positive two, see? Positive two. Oh, man. Now, okay, let's look at this. Uh, okay, left-hand side, calcium. I treat this one like boys, okay? Send so right-hand side, three girls. Two boys and three girls, uh-oh, dancing party. Uh-oh, no way. So, okay, we're gonna exchange this number. Left-hand side is two. So I'm going to give this one two. See, two, oh, then parenthesis, the whole thing, okay, just like this one. Then what about the left-hand side? Oh, so exchange this number, so three. Okay, so I'm going to put three right there, see? Then, oh, wait a minute, two times three, which is a positive, what, six. Okay, what about this one? Oh, two times negative three, which is a negative six. Oh, that's right, six boys and six girls, perfect. Oh, they can have dancing party. So, we're talking about stoichiometry. That's right. Okay, now, I give you a homework today. Okay, so now, uh, you in third grade, elementary school, maybe fourth grade, hey, you, you can remember this one. Okay, one through 20. Only 20 friends, okay? So, first one is hydrogen, the last one is calcium. Oh, right here, oh, potassium is hiding back here. Okay, so now, uh, then 20, that's it. Okay, then I'll fix you up later. Okay, I teach you everything. I'm going to show you everything. Okay, so now all you got to remember just the 20 right here. Oh, uh, promise me. Then one more today is Dr. Brinkelhoff. Oh, that's it. Okay, Dr. Brinkelhoff. Okay, BR. Okay, capital letter, small letter right here. Okay, then I bring. Hoff. <laughs> Just like this. That's doctor's name, right? Okay, so we call some doctor. Okay, so Dr. Brinkelhoff. So only seven. Okay, so Dr. Brinkelhoff right here. Okay, so bromine, iodine, nitrogen, chlorine, hydrogen, oxygen, then fluorine. Oh, fantastic. Now, okay, so we call these are Okay, diatomic, diatomic, uh-huh, so di means two, see, di, atom, see, two atoms together make one element, that's it, that has to be, because only these seven of them, they cannot stand by themselves, okay, so, just like this one, by, by itself, bromine has to be two, iodine two, nitrogen two, chlorine two, hydrogen two, oxygen two, Florin 2. You know what? I know you. You remember this one already. Okay, so Dr. Brinkelhoff. Okay, they are diatomic, so by themselves, like a, uh, maybe H2O. Okay, just like this one. Oh, together, that's okay. So only one oxygen. But by itself, okay, so like hydrogen, hydrogen has to be O. So H2, that's it. That's a hydrogen gas. Very stable. Okay, they not gonna be crazy, okay? Now we are back here again. Oh, calcium phosphate. 
man so we can put numbers right here right oh that's right so okay this one has to be two this one has to be three that's why calcium phosphate now I want you to look at this one. Oh, this is salt, right? Table salt. We eat this one every day. That's right. Okay, now, oh, so we do electrolysis. That we separate this one. Okay, then we're gonna have uh, sodium and chlorine. Okay, now, uh, what about chlorine? As soon as you look at it, oh, oh, Dr. Brinkelhoff. You have to think about that one first, okay? This one has to be two. See, by itself. Okay, together, that's okay, left hand side. But, okay, left hand side is okay again. Okay, right hand side, you have to put two here. That means, uh oh, as soon as you look at this one, CL is the only one. That's why you have to put two front of this one. Two thirds. That's it. Now, oh, we count sodium. Okay, sodium is two sodium, see, right here. Okay, two. Now, right hand side, only one. That's why you have to put two right here. See, now you make sense, right? Okay, the right hand side has to be like this one. Left hand side must be like that. One more chemical equation right here. Water. Oh, electrolysis. We separate this one by electrical power. Okay, so oh, then we're going to have a hydrogen. So also water is a very interesting. So many bondings okay hydrogen bonding and covalent bonding and uh, like this okay electrolysis okay so ionic bonding okay so anyway okay hydrogen oh dr brinkelhoff okay so you have to put two right here right okay so that means okay so hydrogen has to be two what about oxygen oh has to be two two but look at this oxygen first okay so this one is a two this one is only one right here. Oh, that's no good. Or you gotta just match this number, right? Okay, that means you gotta put two right here. Okay, then two oxygen, two oxygen. Perfect. Okay, this is the oxygen gas, right? Okay, what about this one? Hydrogen? Oh, wait a minute. Two, okay, water molecules. So four hydrogens together, right? Say four. That means this one is only two. That's why you gotta put two in front of it. So fantastic. This is hydrogen gas. Man, great. Okay, don't forget this 20 uh, atoms and Dr. Brinkelhoff. Very important.